Hi everyone. Hope you'll subscribe. And welcome to the channel. Today it's the Clover Valley Classic Original Potato Chips. Okay, my glasses off and I'm just good. And now I'm going to make the... I need to take the food out to make it a thumbnail, don't I? This is not normally something that I would review on my channel, but I had no food for supper about a week ago. It's a long story. It's, don't worry about it. So I went out and got these. I thought they were I thought they were Pringles whenever I was young. Well, back in the late 60s, 70s, you saw Pringles advertised on TV. And I just saw the little, the little container here, and I thought that's what this was. But apparently, there, I guess there's no... I guess anybody can make something like this. Let's go ahead and get these things out here. The truth is... I had too many of them, and I almost didn't, I, I wasn't going to make this a video, but I decided to at the last minute, so I still have half of them left. And also, while I was setting up for the video, I went in and I had some. They're just really addictive. Maybe it's the salt in them, I mean... I don't know what it is. So these will not be around very long. Here is like a little... Maybe I turn this like that. And here's what they look like. Made a little design for you. Let's go ahead and do that. Get that thumbnail thing out of the way, okay? There's a stupid looking face. Perfect for social media. Perfect for YouTube. Here's one a little closer up. And it's shaped like a... Well, it has a... They're all shaped like this. They're just like a Pringle, as I remember the Pringles. Let's go ahead and taste it again. Not the first time today. Like I said, I got into these a little bit too early. And I... I came very close to eating them all up even before I made the video. In fact, I didn't plan to make a video about it. But it's such a simple little thing. It seems like my videos have been too complicated lately with a bunch of different stuff. Some of them. Mmm. Mm -mm. You can hear them break. Sort of like an ASMR thing. I guess you can have some kind of a dip with them, you know? Maybe like sour cream or cheese. You can think of all kinds of things. But I wouldn't do that. I want them just simply like they are. What about an ASMR chewing sound? They were about three or four three or four dollars for this little container. I looked for the original Pringles in the supermarket today when I went shopping and I couldn't find I couldn't find them. I guess they still make them. But the weird thing is I was trying to did I say it cost three or four dollars, right? I was trying to find these online and I, I typed in Clover Valley, the classic original but potato crisps. And I couldn't find it anywhere. Mm -hmm. 
I wonder how two at a time will taste. If you're in a hurry. Well, that tastes like two, two of these chips. And I guess three would taste like three. They certainly are salty. These are some salty dogs. I just did that. They're so light and fluffy. You can eat them just about as fast as you can. This is quite a little container for it though. Hello, hello. You can hear the ocean in it. The Atlantic. The Pacific. Can you hear the ocean? Maybe not. I remember my dad told me, I grew up on a farm of course, and he said that the can of tomatoes costs more than the actual tomatoes in the can. The farmer gets less money for the tomatoes than the company gets just for the uh, for the manufactured can, and I'm sure that's the same with these. The potatoes they go in this is just a real little a real little part of the price. It's almost nothing, I would say. You're paying for this box basically. You're paying for this this circular round container. Let's talk about it very quickly. It's gluten free. For those of you who are concerned about that, it has a, a per one ounce serving, it has 140 calories. Probably a lot for some of you. It's nothing for me. And it's a, it's a pretty good bit of sodium, 125 milligrams. It's about 8, 6% of your daily value. But one good thing about it is it has almost no sugar. See that? Sugar? It's kind of blurry from here. There's about uh, 11 of these crisps. They're not called potato chips, they're called crisps. Uh, a little saturated fat there. What's the first main ingredient? Is dried potatoes. And in princess's dried well, it's just dried potatoes. Then it has some some kind of chemical that I can't really can't really understand or relate to. And these are made in Canada. They're distributed by some company in Tennessee. They contain bioengineered food ingredients. All right. Every time I go to the store, I always ask, do you have any bioengineered food ingredients? Store in a cool, dry place at an ambient temperature. An ambient temperature. I don't know. I think that's all I can say about that. It's amazing to me that this, that this container, I'm sure it costs more than these, than the and the little potato the crisps that went inside. And I looked up Pringles on Wikipedia, because that's what it reminded me of. 
and it said there was some kind of an FDA uh, problem, a problem with the FDA calling them by calling them potato chips. So they had to refer to them as crisps, something about that. I don't remember exactly. I should be talking about the Pringles because there was a there's a lot of stuff on there about Pringles and how they were made and discovered and, and everything like that. Or how they were invented, actually. Mm. As much trouble as they went to, as Pringles went to, to to learn how to make these kind of things, I thought there would have been like a patent or something that would have prevented somebody else from doing this. Or maybe it's just considered a generic process now. I don't know. But this Clover Valley has it. I don't know. Something to research. I think I already mentioned subscribe to the channel and like the video. I'm not sure. And drop a comment. Tell me if you tried these before or if you tried Pringles. I guess they're still around. Let me know what you think about them. Like I said, it's not often that I try a snack food like this. Mmm. It's kind of a non-food, you know. It seems like it's just kind of a vehicle for to deliver salt. It makes you thirsty. <coughs> How many are left? About about that much. Eat one at a time makes it last longer. I guess we've exhausted this this video so there you are clover valley classic original potato crisps not chips but crisps peace out <laughs>